Hi guys, Dan's Dollars here. A very good evening to you all. So here we go then. We are back with an evening coin hunt and this evening we'll be looking through £100 of 50p's on the channel. Hopefully getting some more coins into this third book that we are doing together. 55 different commemoratives are in the book. 17 standing our way on completing all of the 72 commemorative finds that you can find in your change or in bank runs, whichever you prefer. If you have managed to find all 72 just in your change, you belong in a league of your own. Unbelievable if you've done that. Again, if you'd started coin collecting a few years ago, it would have been considerably easier. So many more people coin collecting now. And it really is so nice to see our family is growing every single day as well. The Dan's Dollars community is over the 22,000. I still can't believe it. I think we've had 50 since then, and that was only about two days ago. Simply incredible. We will continue to grow and hopefully together all of our coin collections will keep growing as well. So we're off to a good start then. We've had a Beatrix Potter, Mr. Jeremy Fisher from 2017. And just then we hit the Sherlock Holmes from 2019. On average, we are getting now between four to six commemorative fines per £100. Two already from the first two bags, halfway to the bottom of those averages. And again, Hopefully we can find some rarer coins as well. It has been around £500 now since we found the last Olympic. And we have been averaging one nearly every £1,000. So hopefully over the course of the weekend, we can get ourselves another Olympic coin in this book. Coming up tomorrow is going to be another one day special of the top commenter. Super frustrating game for some. I do apologise for that. Again, three points for the first comment on any of my videos. Two for second and one for third. All of the points will get added up over the course of the day. Tomorrow, we are going to do a maximum points of 10 to try and keep it super fair and interesting nonetheless. If you do hit that maximum of 10 and you're on your own, you will win a 2022 Jubilee 50p coin featuring Queen Elizabeth II on horseback, like the 1953 Coronation Crown. That version not released for circulation. Stop quickly there, we've hit a 2016 Peter Rabbit. Always nice to find the Peter Rabbit full face half whisker and we've hit a 2017. As we know now, if we do see 2017 on the back, it's either the rarest shield or one of the Beatrix Potters and we hit the Benjamin Bunny, the most common of those 13 designs. Again, back to the top commenter, 10 points will be the maximum. If only one person hits that 10 points tomorrow, they will win the Jubilee 50p coin. Again, the uncirculated version. If more than one person hits that maximum of 10, you will all be fighting it out in that bowl of doom. The first name from the bowl will win the prize. Again, I really do hope that you're enjoying the channel's giveaways at the moment. Try to keep them as fun and exciting as possible. If you do have any suggestions on how you want the giveaways doing or any other games for the channel, please again do let me know in the comments section below and I will try and do everything that I can for you amazing people at home, please do stay safe. It is super windy. I've seen a few people commenting. Have a chill day tomorrow. Don't go hunting for that Jubilee coin if you haven't found it yet. It will find its way into your collections at home. I really do promise you that. Have a weekend off it. Don't go out tomorrow. Sit back and relax. I know that some people unfortunately will be working. Hopefully that's not too bad for you as well. But definitely have a day off the post offices tomorrow. Two more coins then in the previous bag and we're on six commemoratives now. We hit the Brexit coin and also Paddington outside St. Paul's Cathedral. Coin number seven and it's not a signed Dan's Dollars one. It is the Benjamin Bunny again. Two of those in this coin hunt. Up to seven commemoratives now. Can we get those double figures this evening? Only a couple bags to go. Hopefully we can get a couple more. And as I say that, we have got the second most common of the Beatrix Potters. The Tale of Peter Rabbit. The second of three Peter Rabbits to be released for UK circulation. Again, unfortunately, the 2019 and also 2020 versions were never released for circulation. Really nice designs as well. Please let me know your favourite of both of those in the comments section below. I have to sway for the 2020 version, even though I do like that 2019 coin. The 2020 version is the one for me. Have we got a bit of a tainted coin here to 2015? I was going to guess the Battle of Britain, but unfortunately it wasn't. Sometimes when they are tainted like that, it has meant that those coins have been kept away in a case like we are doing here, or one of the folders, slightly tainted. 
Must just have been an old coin, that one. So let's see what we've got today. We've got two Benjamin Bunny coins. We've also got the tail of Peter Rabbit. We've got the full face half whisker Peter Rabbit as well. A lot of Beatrix Potters in this one. We've also got the Mr. Jeremy Fisher. The Peace of Spirit and Friendship with All Nations. The Brexit coin. We also there had the Paddington and the Sherlock Holmes 50p. Please do let me know your star find of this coin on. But for me, it does have to be the Peter Rabbit full face half whisker. I really do wish you all an amazing weekend. Stay safe and as always guys, thanks for watching.